2019, GMC Kenyon SLT, 2019, GMC Kenyon Diesel, 2019, GMC Kenyon Denali Diesel, 2019, GMC Kenyon AT4, New Cars by. Welcome to our car blog, this time we will be share information about the latest cars is coming from GMC brand. The title of the article we take is 2019, GMC Kenyon SLT, 2019, GMC Kenyon Diesel, 2019, GMC Kenyon Denali Diesel, 2019, GMC Kenyon AT4, New Cars by. We will be try discuss details about this car, ranging from, reviews, concept, redesign, rumors, exterior, interior, specs, changes, engine, colors, pictures, release date and also prices. Congratulations to read and we hope you enjoy it and then we'll come back again here. 2019, GMC Kenyon SLT, 2019, GMC Kenyon Diesel, 2019, GMC Kenyon Denali Diesel, 2019, GMC Kenyon AT4, New Cars by, the 2019, GMC Kenyon is a solid mid-size truck thanks to its terrific and diverse powertrain options, refined interior, and classy demeanor. The 2019, GMC Kenyon is a mid-size pickup with hints of upscale flair, enough for a 5.2 out of 10 on our scale. Like its platform mate, the Chevrolet Colorado, the 2019 Kenyon can't quite stack up to its full-size companions, but at nearly 19 feet from end to end, it's no small fry. The Kenyon comes in several trim levels, SL, Kenyon, SLE, All-Terrain, SLT, and Denali, ranging from utilitarian to near luxury. Those who opt for the all-terrain trim will get a helping of off-road styling details, but this is no rock climber like the Colorado ZR2. For 2019, the Kenyon got a mild refresh, including a new infotainment system with cloud-connected navigation and automatic software updates. There's also the option for parking sensors, a six-way power-adjustable driver seat on several trims, a new 17-inch SLE wheel design, and four new colors, dark sky metallic, smoky quartz metallic, blue emerald metallic, and Sedona metallic. The Kenyon comes in a variety of sizes, including extended or crew cab bodies with a short 5'2 bed or long 6'2 bed, with a long bed the only option on the extended cab version. Engine options include a 2.5 liter inline 4, 3.6 liter V6, or turbo diesel 2.8 liter inline 4. A 6 speed manual transmission is standard on some inline 4 models, and a 6 speed automatic is optional for the gas and diesel 4 cylinder engines, while the V6 can be had with an 8 speed automatic. The Kenyon comes in either rear or four-wheel drive like most pickups. Though it's no athlete, the Kenyon is quiet and agreeable on road, and with the diesel can deliver up to 30 mpg on the highway. The mighty diesel also tows up to 7,700 pounds, meeting the usual needs for many pickup buyers. While they share engines, platforms, and more, the Kenyon and Colorado differ greatly in their trim levels and intended buyers. Where the Colorado ZR2 off-road bruiser represents the best Colorado money can buy, GMC's Kenyon Denali piles on chrome trim and luxury features for those looking for a posher pickup experience. Styling The 2019 GMC Kenyon is ruggedly handsome on the outside but has a soft side within. If you like the looks of the full-size Sierra, you should find no fault with the 2019 GMC Kenyon which we've awarded a 7 out of 10 for its squared-off exterior and car-like interior. The Kenyon's boxy shape is emphasized by its tall grille and rectangular headlights and wheel arches, giving it a more business-like look than the Kavya Colorado though the two are almost indistinguishable from the side. The high, rising belt line gives the Kenyon a slightly sportier look than other trucks. Offered in either extended or crew cab configuration, both versions of the Kenyon come with two doors on each side, either rear half doors on the extended cab and full-size doors on the crew. The extended cab model is available only with a longer 6'2 bed, while the crew cab can be had with a bed that's a foot shorter if desired. The curvy dashboard places most controls high up and well within the driver's reach, and while the Kenyon isn't out to impress at the bottom of the range, the higher brow Denali adds faux wood trim and leather upholstery. Performance The 2019 GMC Kenyon hits a high note with its engine and gearbox choices. The 2019 GMC Kenyon can be had with a wide variety of powertrain choices, and for that we've awarded it 6 out of 10 points for performance. If you're cross-shopping the Kenyon with its fraternal twin the Colorado, you may have noticed that the Chevy received 7 out of 10 points in this category. That extra point is for the Colorado's hardcore ZR2 model, which packs some serious off-road hardware onto an already capable truck. The Kenyon instead eschews off-road prowess for comfortable style. The entry-level engine is a 2.5-liter inline four-cylinder that makes 200 horsepower and 191 pound-feet top torque. As standard, Kenyon pairs six-speed manual transmission with rear-wheel drive, and a six-speed automatic is option with rear-wheel drive and standard with four-wheel drive. 
The upgraded engine choice is a 3.6 liter V6 with a respectable 308 horsepower and 275 pound feet, and it is by far the more popular engine choice for its superior power and decent fuel economy. The V6 gets a beefed up 8 speed automatic transmission as well. Finally, buyers with an eye for torque and efficiency can opt for a 2.8 liter turbocharged diesel inline 4, which makes only 186 horsepower but a whopping 369 pound feet of torque. Paired with a 6 speed automatic, the diesel impressed us with its refined performance and capability thanks to the torque, towing up to 7,700 pounds when properly equipped. The gas V6 receives a 7,000 pound tow rating, but feels more heavily taxed when towing close to that limit. For those interested in traveling off the beaten path, the All Terrain X package is a better choice than the standard All Terrain for its Goodyear All Terrain rubber and other off road goodies. Canyons equipped with four wheel drive get a stronger transfer case with an automatic mode, something not available on other trucks. Comfort and quality. A well finished interior and some genuinely luxurious trim on the Denali model aren't quite enough to offset the 2019 GMC Canyon small backseat. While the 2019 GMC Canyon offers ample space up front, rear passengers will find themselves a bit squeezed, warranting a 5 out of 10 on our points scale. If you're looking for a Canyon SL on a dealer lot, you're unlikely to find one, as it's aimed mainly at fleet sales which prefer vinyl seats and flooring for quick, easy cleaning. The base Canyon and higher SLE trims have cloth seats, while SLT and Denali get standard leather upholstery. Despite the Denali's swankier look and reputation, it's not much more than an appearance package, and comes up short in actual added features. Whichever Canyon you choose, you'll find solid build quality throughout the interior. SL models get a standard power seat for the driver's side, but back seat space is tight and works better as extra storage. The crew cab offers better interior space naturally, but this is no family crossover SUV. With either the 5'2 or 6'2 bed, the Canyon is decidedly mid-size, making small pickups of days gone by seem like toys in comparison. Safety The 2019 GMC Canyon is no safety superstar, with missing tech features and so-so crash tests. Though the 2019 GMC Canyon is a thoroughly modern truck, it still lacks in the safety department, with sub-PAR crash test scores and limited active safety equipment. The 2019 Canaan rates 2 out of 10 points on our scale based on last year's crash test results. We'll update this space when 2019 crash test scores are announced. All Canyons are equipped with anti-lock brakes, 6 airbags, and a rear-view camera, and the driver alert package includes forward collision and lane departure warnings, but not automatic emergency braking. This package is optional on SLE and SLT models, and standard on Denali. The Canyon also received a 4-star rating from the NHTSF out of 5 stars, and the IIHS found anomalies in the way extended and crew cab models handle a crash. The crew cab models all scored good in the IIHS tests, but the extended cab model only managed an acceptable result in the small overlap front and side impact tests. With no automatic emergency braking offered, the Canyon is ineligible for the IIHS's top safety pick award. Features Even base 2019 GMC Canyons come well equipped, and the top of the line Denali trim could pass for a luxury truck. What the 2019 GMC Canyon lacks Indiana safety features and scores, it makes up for in available options and trim levels. The terrific infotainment systems, wide customization options, and the Denali trim's luxury appointments warrant 7 out of 10 points on our scale. Fleet buyers would be smart to opt for the value-conscious SL model, which packs only a standard power driver's seat, windows, and locks, and a 7.0-inch infotainment screen with Apple CarPlay and Android Auto. The SL is only available in extended cab configuration with vinyl seats and rear-wheel drive. Stepping up to the base Canyon nets cloth upholstery and the option for four-wheel drive and the mighty V6. Most buyers will opt for the SLE trim or above, though, which ups the infotainment screen size to 8.0 inches and adds optional navigation, alloy wheels, a leather-wrapped steering wheel, and options for heated seats, skid plates, and more. The all-terrain model adds an off-road suspension to the SLE trim, as well as skid plates, recovery hooks, and subtle off-road inspired styling cues. Add the X package for a spray and bedliner, and Goodyear all-terrain tires. The Canyon SLT gets standard leather upholstery 19-inch wheels, power front seats, and remote start. The Denali model kicks things up a notch with cooled front seats, navigation, Bose audio, and 20-inch wheels. Our advice? A Canyon SLE with the all-terrain X package is just right for most buyers. Fuel economy. The 2019 GMC Canyon can be plenty fuel efficient with the right options, but is average for a truck otherwise. Thanks to its diesel powertrain option, the 2019 GMC Canyon is more miserly on fuel than other midsize pickups, and even some midsize sedans. 
We've given the powertrain lineup a 4 out of 10 based on the most popular V6, 4-wheel drive configuration, but the different engine options each have their merits. The 2.5-liter inline-4 represents the base engine option, and rear-wheel drive models average 20 mpg city, 26 highway, and 22 combined with either the manual or automatic transmission selected. With 4-wheel drive equipped, those numbers drop slightly to 19-24-21 mpg with the automatic transmission only. The V6 is easily the thirstiest of the lineup at 3.6 liters of displacement and manages 18-25-20 mpg with rear-wheel drive. Four-wheel drive models earn 17-24-19 mpg. Rounding out the lineup, the 2.8-liter turbo diesel is rated at an impressive 22-30-25 mpg with rear-wheel drive and 20-28-23 mpg with four-wheel drive, but with the higher added cost of diesel, you'll have to check the math yourself on whether it will save you some money over time. Thanks.